Dawn, good to see you. I, I tried to bring in earlier. I've had stuff on. Still do. Yeah. Well, look, let me help. We'll find a way to get him back, OK? If you're talking about Lucas, I'm picking him up on Monday. Right. <laughs> Sorry, you just, you just don't seem very... What? Well, excited. I mean, it's, it's massive. This is good news, isn't it? Yeah. For me and him. You can't be anywhere near him. OK, well, I understand that you need to get him settled in and everything. You need to leave me alone, Jamie. Why? We should be celebrating. I, mean, I can't wait to get to know him. It's never going to work. Of course it is. No, I'm not going to go around saying that I'm his new dad or anything. I can't be with you. Well, why not? I thought, I thought we talked about this. Ask your mum. This has got nothing to do with her, and I've already told her to back off. Oh, you think she listened? For now, yeah. Then how come she spiked my drink right before I had a meeting with social services? Uh, sorry, I don't understand. She knew about that meeting and she was trying to stop me getting Lucas back. And you think she spiked you? I know she did! OK, all right. Look, what happened exactly? I tasted it at the first sip and I poured it away. But if I hadn't... You would have lost him. Have you told the police? No, I've not said anything to anyone because it's my word against hers and there's no evidence. No, she's not getting away with this. Do what you like, Jamie, but she's never going to stop. She was doling out threats earlier. What threats? <sighs> Nothing specific, but I got the message. And I am not risking her wrecking things for me and Lucas. So you need to go. No, Dawn, no, I, I want to be with you. It's not your decision. It's over. <laughs>